does a number have a picture and an address isn't it a crazy question well it isn't a crazy question at all the answer is yes the number has a picture and an address isn't it amazing okay if a number has a picture and an address then where it is how can we see it so here is the answer actually a point is picture of a number this point can be very large and this point can be very small it can be a very small point like this and it can be a large point like this it can be as large as a star in the universe or a planet and it can be as small as an atom or subatomic particles that lie within the atom that is neutrons protons electrons etc it can be a tennis ball this point can talk about position of something in the space in anywhere this point can tell us about distance between the two people it tells us about time population data money and so many things For example, in this horizontal line, we have four points and this line is vertical line that represents the same numbers in the form of points. The starting point is considered as zero. To the right of zero, there are positive numbers, positive points. To the left of zero, there are negative numbers, negative points. In the same way, the starting point here in this vertical line is considered as zero. The numbers on top of zero are positive in the downward direction these are called negative numbers negative points a point can line on a surface the surface may be very 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 large and this surface may be very 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 small the surface can be a floor a ground a whiteboard this surface can also be considered in your mind lying anywhere in the space okay now this is the point which lies in 3d space this 3d space can be very very large and it can be very very small it can be uh, as small as a small cube uh, similar to matchbox and it can be very large and contain the complete planet this point which represents which is a picture of uh, number five is at a distance of five steps and this point which represents which is the picture of minus two is at a distance two steps from the left of zero okay so the negative sense shows the left concept and the positive uh, numbers the positive point shows the right concepts the upward points from the starting point shows positive numbers the downward uh, points or numbers uh, that are below zero uh, they show negative numbers okay now address of a point is how many steps is it on the right on the left on top on bottom or on the height this is our height from a starting point this is our starting point here and this is our starting point here the starting point is known as origin here we are going to share one example with you 2d space considered on the air and this uh, is a three-dimensional space in in this space we have in this 2d space we have an airplane and in this 3d space we have an airplane we are going to talk about its address in the form of point in 2d space and then we are going to talk about it its address uh, in the form of point in 3d space if we consider each step uh, in the form of miles and this is our starting point in uh, 2d space or a 2d plan then the uh, location of the plane is such that it is three miles away uh, from the starting point in the left direction and two miles on the top of starting point so the address of this plane is minus three from the left and two to the top 
Now, if we want to locate the plan, if we want to trace the plan in the space, in 3D space, what are these 2, 3 and 5? Let's explain it. Let we have a ground which is given a green uh, color. And uh, let this is our origin, our starting point. This ground is made with the help of X and Y axes and the height is represented in the form of Z axis. The plan is two miles away from the starting point along X axis and the plan is three miles away from the starting point along Y axis. Its height is along the Z direction and is given by uh, five miles. In air defense system, two kinds of radars are used. One is termed as 2D radar and the other is termed as 3D radar. 2D radar works on the basis of 2D space and 3D radar works on the principle of 3D space. Why do we need pictures and geometry of numbers? We want to visualize mathematics and without geometry and points it is impossible. We want to better understand many natural laws that happen all around us and physical phenomena. And as a result, we discover and invent many things that can make our lives easy. Thank you for watching. Like, share and subscribe to Ask's channel for more videos and updates.